Great job. Now we're going to take a straight edge. Miss Aldana doesn't have a ruler, but I have this cool pamphlet from my alma mater, which is the Maryland Institute College of Art, where I went to school. So I'm going to use that as a straight edge. Um, I am going to um, find the middle of my back side of my t-shirt and I'm going to do that by actually taking my, you can take a ruler and find the middle by measuring, in this case this is eight and a half by eleven, so you would measure half of that. So half of eight is four and half of a half is a fourth. So you would measure four and a fourth, 4.25 in other words, from the top to the bottom, which is about here, and draw a straight line to the other side. Um, in my case, I don't have a ruler, so I'm gonna get creative and use my big brain and find whatever's around the house. I'm gonna fold it in half so that I can find the middle point. And again, I'm gonna be marking where that is. I do this often. I actually don't use rulers very much, although they're really fun. And um, this is just perfect. This actually lines up with the corners of my t-shirt. Can you see that? Okay, and then you're gonna use your pen to mark where the halfway point is. And then do the same to the other side. And then you're gonna draw a line Here's one point, here's the other point. You know what? I need to draw a middle point because it's too long and I can't connect my dots. So I'm gonna draw a third dot. And I'm gonna connect dot one to the middle dot. Now the trick to writing um, on t-shirts is you have to do quick motions like this. So if you're using paper, you can just draw a straight line, you can drag your pen, but if you're doing a t-shirt, because it stretches, you have to pick your pen up a lot and you're kind of just making dashes, okay, like that. And I'm gonna connect my middle dot to the other side so I can draw a straight line. You want to do that lightly because it's just a guideline and the guideline is going to help you um, write your words. Okay, so we are going to be writing I Run With Maud. I Run With Maud is a campaign that his high school coach created to call attention and to get people like us from around the country and around the world to support a Maud artery. So I run with Maud is a challenge for everybody to walk or run for 2.23 miles. 2.23 is important because that's the day marking his death, February 23rd. So I'm going to be doing that challenge today with the t-shirt that we're making right now. And I'm going to post it on social media with hashtag I run with Maud. And this is a way to honor that moment where he was alone and was fighting for his life. Okay, so we are going to be writing I, let's figure this out, I run with Maud. That's going to be hard because we have I run with, which is a lot of letters. How many letters is that? I run, R-U-N, I, R-U-N, with, W. I T H that's eight letters plus you have to count the space in between the letters so that that's going to be very small and then down here maud m a u d those are four letters with space in between them so maud is going to be a lot bigger than the eight letters that are going to fit up here so there's eight letters up here, four down here. These are gonna be about 
mm, like half the width of these down here. These down here are gonna be twice as thick. So let's see how we're gonna figure that out. Is it gonna be perfect? Yes, because you made it. All right, let's get our marker for the next step.